Yeah, I'm stuck. I, I pull over to the side of the road here, and unfortunately, it's very deep, and this car is now stuck. So, what's your Mackie snack, Mackie? Yeah, it's very, very light snow, unfortunately. So, once again, here we are, stuck on the side of the road in an all wheel drive car. So, what do you think we can do? Can we push ourselves out of here, you think? And it's not a video of going to test sheet. Yeah, we need a we rope. Need a, we need a rope to pull ourselves out of here. We could try, we could try pushing. But look, come on, come on, come over here. Bring the camera over here. We are good and properly stuck right there. Check it out. I mean, this thing is, we could probably dig ourselves out if we had a shovel. But look how deep that is. It seems like every time Andre and I get together, we manage to get stuck. In fact, it wasn't all that long ago that Andre and I managed to get a brand new Forester stuck in the Colorado mountains. Today, it was the Infinity's turn. After doing some impromptu all-wheel drive testing of the traction control system up the Loveland Gauntlet. All right, in case you're wondering what the Loveland Pass is like, with snow conditions being this bad, I'm gonna turn the traction control off. And I'm gonna try to accelerate up this hill. And right now, it's not even all that steep. So check it out, here we go. Traction control off. What made this day especially daunting is that it was cold. In fact, dangerously cold, one degree below zero. And as much as I'd like to make fun of my Russian friend's garb, his funny Russian hat, I wish I had one on because getting an infinity stuck on the Loveland gauntlet while testing the all-wheel drive system is no time to not have a hat. Oh, Andre, I think I'm beached. Yeah, I can't. I'm tall, but nothing is going Yeah, I think we're good and properly beached, man. We need a rope to pull this out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we're kind of stuck. Хорошо, ребята, давай попробуем, как эта резина сделает на снегу. Хорошо? Сейчас. Роман, мы можем это использовать. You want to use it as a shovel? Да, да. You know, if we can get, if we get enough people, maybe if we get enough people, we could get it pushed out of here. What do you think? More bit, more bit, more bit. It's not working as a shovel. Skis do not make a good shovel. I'm in neutral. I'm in neutral. I don't want to tear the car out. There's no real hook to attach it to. Out of here. Let me, let me, before you go, let me, just, yeah. let me, let me uh, I didn't want to give any gas because I didn't want it to get wrapped around. Right. So let me just, nice and lightly, nice and lightly, let me just pull out of here. Make sure we're free. Thanks, guys, Thanks guys. Look at that. I pulled in here thinking the snow, check this out. I pulled in here thinking the snow was, uh, Pavement, as it turned out, there wasn't pavement. All I did was bury the car and got it beached. All right, Andre, once again, we get stuck. All right, up, up, up the gauntlet. I'm the Loveland gauntlet. Let's do it.
give a Russian some snow, and this is what he does. Oh my, oh my, Andre, was that fun? <laughs> that is what I call some Russian ballet out there. <laughs> nice work. Ladies and gentlemen, in this corner we have the brand new 2014 Buick Regal. And here's the important part, all wheel drive turbo. And here, the brand new 2014 Infiniti Q60S all wheel drive. And up there is the Loveland Pass. And today, we're gonna mash these cars up, but not the cars themselves, the all wheel drive system, to see which one is better, taking on the brand new TFL car, Loveland Gauntlet. And that's coming up next on the Fast Lane Car. Even though up here the turbocharged Buick is probably just a little bit uh, better option. Whoa, there goes the oh. back. Oh, did you see that back just came out of it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, my, 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 my. And you didn't even press it too much. Yeah. Minus three at the top of this. Holy cannoli, dude. It's getting extreme up here. Ooh.